Heartland International Fashion Week kicks off tonight. And oh boy, are you in store for some amazing designs. Join me now with details are Heartland International Fashion Week founder and CEO, Boss Today E. Warren, and Project Director Kanitha Gatlin. Good morning. Good Welcome morning. back. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you so much. All right, so we are excited. It is season four, and mm -hmm. I was talking to you earlier. You were like, I'm ready. This year yeah. hits differently. So, what can our Great Day KC <laughs> viewers expect this season? Yes, this year does hit different. <laughs> A lot of preparation has gotten in, gone into this year. The team was got a little bigger. Yeah. So it was easier to just kind of manage all of the moving parts. So this year, listen, of course, being so blessed. Yeah. And so um, just the, the new designers that are coming yeah. this year um, have blown my mind. I love so that. So we have new designers in the likes of Hawa Couture, yeah. Z-Wear, handmade design by Katka. She is actually in the Slovak and she shipped the items to us. Really? So it is going to literally be an explosion of international fashion again. Again. Season four. I love that. Yes. And something else I love that you do, Balsa Day, you partner with uh, local nonprofits. Uh, a portion of the proceeds are going back to a nonprofit this year. Yes. Who did you choose and why? So we chose to donate a portion of our proceeds this year to the Nigerian Women Association of Greater Kansas City. They have been around since 1989. Oh, wow. And a thriving organization here in Kansas City, um, founded by Dr. Rose Ia Warren. She is the founder and CEO of um, Nigerian Women Association. What they are trying to do even more in the community now is partner with the schools to help with the younger girls. I love that. So it's going to be almost like a sisterhood, big sister, um, foster mom type of feel when it comes to going to the schools here in the city and surrounding areas and just taking in some of those girls yeah. with items such as, you know, the times when, you know, you're getting into your adulthood. Absolutely. Oh, who do you need? What do you need? How yeah. can we help? What can we provide for you? Especially if you are in a family that they really can't support you in getting you all of the items all that are needed. All of the essentials. Essentials. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. So I'm super excited this Good. year, you know, to donate the proceeds to the Nigerian Women Association. Oh, that's a, an amazing partnership. All yeah. right. So you talked about the, the new designers and I'm looking at some beautiful models over here and I want you all at home to see this, giving you a glimpse of what you're going to be able to see this week. Now, Kanitha, the, tell us a little bit about what our models are wearing. Yes, so the traditional Filipino dress attire is called the turno. The turno is actually made with luxurious fabrics such as pina, which is a pineapple fiber. Okay. Juicy, which is a banana fiber, silk and satin. And most of these materials are made with very embroidered, intricate details, yeah. adding to the elegance of the dress. Oh my goodness, I love this. This is yes. beautiful. And you spoke about a uh, Filipino. Yes. So this is like a, a Filipino dress. Both beautiful. of these are Filipino Cultural Center, which yeah. will also grace our stage on Saturday night as well. Awesome. And then you, you're also uh, kicking off tonight with a gala yes. that's going to be at the Filipino uh, Center Cultural Foundation. Center. So uh, t tell me a little bit about that. So yeah, the kickoff gala is tonight at the Filipino Cultural Center in Overland Park, Kansas. And the theme for tonight's gala is a royal affair. Okay, bring so, your crown. Yes, bring your <laughs> crown, bring your Bridgerton type feel. Yes. Okay, we'll attire and couture. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and come and enjoy, come and kick off season four with us. We are super excited. Doors open at six tonight. So we'll be there from six to nine. And then kicking off Fashion Week tomorrow, right? From the 22nd to the 25th, we're gonna be at Stony Creek okay. Hotel and Conference Center in Overland Park, or in Independence, Missouri. And you're going to actually end with a, like a bridal fashion show. Yes. So any, you know, newly engaged brides, make sure you're there on Saturday and who knows, you might find that dress. Say yes, yes to the dress <laughs> Say yes at Harlan the International dress. Fashion Week. Well, ladies, thank you so much. Thank you. Looking forward to being there with you all on thank Thursday. You. I will be the host 
for the Thursday night uh, runway show, but everyone at home watching the Harlan International Fashion Week, it kicks off tonight with a gala at the Filipino Cultural Center Foundation. And again, models will strut the runway wearing the latest designs from local designers, international designers, starting tomorrow through Saturday. And to purchase your tickets, you can visit the website listed right there on your screen. And don't forget,